is Chanel Trotman, and I'm a sports therapist operating out of Barbados. I've been, I've been a qualified sports therapist for about 10 years now. My journey started years ago when I was younger. I always was involved in sports, was always active, always told myself. Eventually, I would like a job where I work in sport. I did a bachelor's in biology and pre-physiotherapy. But after that, I decided, you know what, I wanted to do a little more where sport is involved because physiotherapy is a broader spectrum. So I did my research and I came across sports therapy in the UK. That's where I went. I did my master's in sports therapy in the UK. Now, sports therapy is still a relatively new field, relatively new meaning in the yeah, last 30 years or so. So a lot of places still don't know a lot about it. And that is the first time I met when I came back home. A lot of professionals never, had never heard about it. They didn't care to do the research, so they were putting me on the back burner. Then I had a few older professionals, a few people who have been, a few physios who have been around, and they took the chance. They took me under their wings. I worked with them. They helped me to hone my skills. I still work closely with them to this day. And that is how I really got going in the business in Barbados. Uh, people ask me a lot, how is it operating in a male dominant field? For me, I've never had any issues. I find that sports, like everything else in life, wants you give that respect, you that respect is returned to you. And especially in a field where you are more than likely working with people at their lowest, athletes when they get injured, you have to be very compassionate, you have to be very understanding. So for me, working in sport usually comes across as being heavy handed and hard, but for me, working in sport, you really have to be compassionate, you really have to be understanding and listen to athletes. So I'm here to say that as a woman in sport, you don't have to be hard, you don't have to be heavy handed. You can be compassionate and still get the job done. Now you know.